Hey YouTube, how's it going today? So this is a quick short video on how to build a Slim Jim antenna for a base station. So it's going to be waterproof, it's going to be in a PVC pipe when it's all done. And the PVC pipe, I already pre-cut it, uh, just needs to be 20 inches. You're going to need a piece of, so I just used some proper cable, this is what I used. Nice thick braid. And let's see what the markings say on this. So, 600 volt GR double uh, I AWM VW dash one SRC. You all type 90 nylon or it's all messed up after that. But yeah, just some cable I got from a buddy. And so this is what was that? I think let's remeasure this real quick. That's right, 37 inches long for the copper cable you need. And I will do the bending on camera so you guys can see that. And then for the connector, this is just a uh, coax connector, but you can get the different, um, uh, what do you call it, the different types of connectors like the PL239 or SMA types. And then you just got your ground or positive and then your ground wire. That comes last. Okay, so the first measurement we do would be measurement B. Because we're gonna start with start with the short side. And that is six point oh seven. It's right about right about there. Ninety degree bend. Gonna have to do a lot of straightening out too. And then half inch, right about there. Check that. Perfect. Straighten it out as you go along, of course. Or at the end, whatever you want to do. Then we're going to do this the second link here, the the main part, which that is 18.2 inches. So we're going to go. down half inch about right here put that down and it's that simple I've made quite a few of these so I have had a little bit of practice yeah straighten it all out and then I'm out of tape right now so I'll have to get some tomorrow but then what you do is you just simply put a piece of tape right here on this gap and then it will close that gap off and then this piece right here you're going to want to do the positive terminal onto this side right here and then the short side and then the negative would be on the long side did, did that right? yep shows in a little diagram Oh. And here's the measurements for you guys. Focus this. Okay. And then, so then here's the pipe right here. And then what you're going to do is you're going to just slide it right into the bottom after it's taped up and you've connected your bottom piece. I don't have the tape or my solder right now so I can't connect this one. But yeah, you're going to slide that up in there 
and then the top right here you're going to put a piece of tape through and then tape it to the sides here so it stops it from going all the way down in and then you'll put a couple pieces of tape over the top and then put a piece of tape around on the side that will seal the top or you can just get a PVC cap and then so what it will look like when it's done it will look like this you get all taped off and ready to go and it's, it's in there it's in there about uh, that far almost two inches and then this end right here I'm just have it ready so I can just put whatever kind of connector I want on that and I have another one of these that I built today and it's up on my roof right now and getting really good signal with it better signal than uh, my previous antenna so very good antennas they work pretty well and uh, just a quick little video on how to make it. And there you go. Please leave a like and please please like, subscribe, and share. <laughs> Couldn't talk there for a second. All right, you guys have a good one. Okay.